Lemon lime, soda skies, lucky like a four leaf clover. Strawberry, slice of life, singing with a sip of nectar. Oh, sweet like honey on a summer day. I'll stick with you through the wind and the rain. Sweet like honey on a summer night, like a busy bee. Goodness. Hey, hi, hello, chat, Adobe, me, Adobe, Rosie, Adobe, back here in the Rose Garden after way too long because life got crazy and I got tired. <laughs> oh, we may be a little laggy. I'm not quite sure what's going on, but it's also just been so long, so everything's waking up. <laughs> Everything is waking up, including me. Um, that's a lie. I've been away for way too long already. Uh, I am currently in between work shifts, and so we are chilling. Dino just alerted the Discord as well. Hello, I've missed you guys. I've missed streaming. I've missed being here. I just, life got, like I said, life got crazy. Uh, I had to cat sit for a while, and so that meant that I had to be out of my place and over to friend's place so that I could actually feed said animals before, even, like, before I would even, like, hit my normal, like, streaming time. God forbid I even try to go after streaming. Those cats did not deserve, did, did nothing to have deserved a uh, 11.30 dinner. That would have, that would have been ridiculous. Um, but I also don't want to mention too many things about my life while it's happening on the off chance that, on the off chance that someone decides to be weird about it. But, you know, it hasn't happened to me yet. Hopefully it won't ever, but I know the longer I keep doing this, the more likely it will. So, till then we just be careful. But bow. But yes, we are currently back here in the in 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 my favorite game, uh, Sky Children of the Light, because there have been a lot of big updates, a lot of big updates, including a uh, season of revival, of which I've got. I did two of the missions off camera because it's been it been two weeks since I've been even been able to stream. So I was like, I'm gonna get this done, and so I got those done because they were very. Very simple and just the fact that it was like I had already done all of the quests necessary for the missions. So it was like a boop 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 boop. So it was, it was chill. It was easy. It was fine. And I'll give you updates on what those actually were on the off chance that you don't play this game yourself and you just rely on watching me. 
Um, is there anything else I need to say? I don't. I don't know. Probably a lot, but might as well just hop on into the game. Bada beam, bada boom. <gasps> Boosh. There's a button. Look at this little candle. I'm standing next to this little monument. Uh, and that's because of something fun. That's because of something fun that I kind of called partway through. I kind of called earlier, but let's hop on over to the aviary for a second. Aviary Village. I got my coffee. It's fantastic. Boom. Because here's a little something that took me ages to figure out because I don't read. But this right here is the teleporter that lets you go back to the home island. We'll talk to our friend in a second. But something that I noticed and I read in the patch notes popped up yesterday. Is this thing over here? Oh my goodness, what's this? A matching monument in which everyone's surrounding it so I can't show you the actual pop-up for the thing. Hold on. Hold on. We'll get... Ooh. Ooh, did you see that? Do you want... Make this your new home. You'll begin here when you launch Sky. Which I'm not going to do it right now. I've been debating it. I've been debating it. But look, even the seasonal candle pops up here. This is where it's gonna be. And what is like, it's not even like normal normal sky streams in which I just pop in, make sure that I'm in my default character stage, and then pick up the candle. But no, it's like the other the other statue did give me the quests, but it this one was the one holding my candle. What was this one? So we have the chance. <laughs> we have the chance to make this our home starter, our starter base. And that's really interesting. And definitely something that I said I wouldn't be surprised if that's what they were doing. And similarly, I'm also not surprised that they still have a way to get back to the home island. And the fact that it's, it's, like, it's an option. You can start in the quaint little home island that we've all known and loved for however long this game has been out. And you'll have, like, definitely a quieter startup. I think is even how they mentioned it in the patch notes. Is that those, for uh, the people that want a smaller, a smaller, like, area to start their game in. Which makes sense, because this area is big and rambunctious and full of life. So to just need like a chill, a chill for a bit before you actually hit that part, fair enough, man. Fair enough. But two things that we did, two things that we that we did real quick um, is if I hop on over here, one of the one of the missions did in fact bring our newest new friend. This, the moments guide is here for our little hats here for our hats we got our flower crown on right now but look at him look at him look at him crouching at us to see see how we look with our little fancy schmancy items oh yeah and I got the I got the moth ears we're gonna stick with the flower crown for now but here's our friend here's our friend we love him we love him this is an area that is now open. Don't know what it's going to be yet. I wouldn't be surprised if this is where, like, um, the, not the seasons guides, but like the day, the um, event guides end up. So I'm sure there's gonna be event guides that are, that still stay on the home island to help teleport you around and give you the cosmetics. But I also think that the ones that are going to be here in the aviary village are going to end up here. It's still too early to tell. It's still too early to tell. We got our friend there. 
I want this cloak. I want this one. It's so pretty. It's so cool. Pop on out. And I think... I think the second one is the... The second one that happened is right in over here. And which we get a quick access to our little friends here in Harmony Hall. And... If you go out that way, it'll take you back out to the village. But hopping back over here, it will take us back out to... Aviary Village. And I think those are the two things that happened. I did also notice something here, because here we have our friend from the from Golden Wasteland. Um, he's looking at a little, a little fella. But hey, let's get, let's get his attention, yeah? Hey. He just falls. He just falls. I feel bad. I feel bad about it. But he's fine. He's vibing. It's like I got scrolls up in here. Uh, this is where the, the, our friend is. Hello. Sleepy salesman. This is not his- this is- that's not the boat where he sells his wares though, that's still back at the home island. But... Let's- let's see what we got next. Follow a friend inside, see how you can help him. And that is our friend from the Season of Enchantment. Whom we brought in earlier and who, uh, during the- during, like, the two weeks that I- that I didn't stream. We also helped him set up the fireworks. And we got his little shop in here with the with the paper boats, as you know. But let's see. Bada beam, bada boom. We've already done this. And it's opened up a shop in here where we can do it, the things that we could get either from the Forgotten Ark or the Jetwing Salesman boat. Look at this. Look at this. It's so cool. And then in here we still have this area. I will say, I think my new little favorite Heidi bit in this area. Up here, look at this. Look at this place. Hold on. We could just take a nap here. Look at this. Ooh, ooh. Bonk. I need a... I need to move a bit so I can actually land on the pillows. Come on. And down three. I still missed it. I'll get I'll get it eventually. I'll nail it. But this is a cute little place. It's a cute little thing. I love it. I love it so much. Um, I'm a little sad that the missions for this season were. <laughs> We're just uh, finishing up the, the the missions from previous seasons. On one hand, it's a fantastic way to make sure that new players like know about it, or like even like returning players will have an easy way to unlock all of those areas and those um, and and uh, and the rewards you can get from that. But as someone who <laughs> But as someone who has already done it beforehand, it's just a very quick bop bop and then I gotta wait two weeks to do it again. <laughs> Ugh. It's fine though. It's chill. But before we do this, let's do a quick pause on the music itself. Make sure we got our game music playing. And let's finish this puppy up. Or maybe you finish it. <laughs> Look at all those colors. <gasps> We're getting a transformation sequence. They're so happy.
Look at all those collars. Swirling around. There's all the fireworks that we've been collecting. So, at 46 candles, we have access to get the hair from before. That's available in 5 days, and this is available in 12 days. So, I guess we'll have to see what that is about. Oh, something that they did add is that we can now hug our friend. This wasn't originally a part of, a part of the tree, but a game company added it. And thank goodness, because I love hugging my friends. This village is so cool. And there's still more work to do. Still more work to be done. Alright, let's hop on over here. Because if I did my time right, we should be able to see this show. Two hours to go. I did not do my time right. I did not do my time right. Whoopsies. Whoopsie boopsies. Uh oh. <laughs> I was I was almost certain that it was gonna start at eleven o'clock my time, cause it's off. It, oftentimes it's off PST because that's where the game company is located. I think. But two hours to go. Woof, woof. I thought it was gonna be starting in like six minutes, but you know what? That's fine. What we're gonna do is we're gonna make sure that our music is back down here so that we can. Pick it back up here in the playlist. Let's go. Let's get those daily quests done. Ugh. 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 Weird. Weird throat. Weird throat. That's fine. We're chilling. We're vibing. Woo. I'm out. Bada beam, bada boom. We get one candle. I get a second candle. Yeah. How many hearts do I need to complete? You? One to one. Jeez, Louise. That game company, please, I beg of you, just give me a way to buy hearts. Whether it's like in a shop or something. I'll use a scent of candles, I'll use it. Alright, and, and we wait here. We wait here. Um. <clears throat> I don't know. Let me tell you about what book I'm reading. I'm reading Lessons in Chemistry currently. It's a pretty good book as far as it goes. I'm enjoying it. Uh, there's a lot of like, because I think it takes place in the 50s if I remember right. I think it takes place in the 50s in which it's following the main character of a, uh, of a female chemist named Elizabeth Zott. Um, and right now, it's still, like, in the early stages of the book. How far into it am I? How far into it am I? I'm about 40% into it. I'm on chapter 18 right now. Um, I'm really enjoying the book as far as it goes. It It's getting reminded about the fact that, you know, women weren't necessarily seen as their own people <laughs> back then. Whether they still, still are today is, like, we're getting better. We're getting better. Um, but it definitely is making me very, like, viscerally angry, angry at some of the people's reactions to whatever the main character does. Because oftentimes their reactions always boil down to, but you're a woman! And it's just like, yes. And? But, tis the times, I guess. The times back then. All right, we're gonna hop on over here first. And we're gonna go down to the hot spring to do, finish our second our second battle of waiting. Get that candle, get the second candle, that the second treasure candle over by, over by the lifts. We're not actually gonna go up the lifts, but then we're gonna quick travel back home and then just go through the gate again. Oh, I goofed it, I goofed it, that's fine. Well, yeah, Lessons in Chemistry. I heard good things about the book, and I'm enjoying it so far. There are moments where I just get 
highly uncomfortable <laughs> and viscerally angry. But that also just tells you that the writing is good. The writing is good because I'm feeling those emotions as a woman who thankfully hasn't had to deal with misogyny to that extent. <laughs> As like I said, we have gotten better over the years. Overall, still not great, but better. I will say my favorite character in Lessons to Chemistry so far is a character that you meet pr pretty early on, so I'm not. it's not like a spoiler or anything. But his name is 630. He is a dog. He is the bestest boy. And the way that this book is going, I know that they're going to... I, I know he's not going to be around for long. <laughs> he's already been around for a good part of the book. And I know he's not going to be around for long because this book is very much in the... Uh, realistic side of... I think it's a fictional book. I don't think this is nonfiction. I think it's like a realistic fiction. I also just didn't think to look. But it's definitely playing into the realistic side of the world. And so I know, I know something's going to happen to that dog and I know it's going to devastate me. It's going to devastate me. I'm not ready. Can I stop doing that, please? I get such good momentum and then I think I'm not going to get thrown into automatic glide and so I hit the glide and then I just ruin it. Goodness gracious. Nice. And oh, not quite, but that's fine. Um, a couple other books that I got recently that I'm looking forward to is I decided to purchase the ebook version of the Odyssey translated by uh, what's her name hold on I look Emily Wilson I got the Odyssey and the Iliad both translated by Emily Wilson uh, I'm a big I'm a big Greek mythology nerd and so <laughs> of course I start I got them first from the library but the way that you the way that it goes on Libby is that if a lot of people are waiting for them you can't renew them it's not like at the physical copies the physical copies in which you just renew them and they can't stop you um, but in Libby it won't let you renew it and so I knew I wasn't gonna be able to finish it but I knew that I was also enjoying what I had been reading so far. So I was like, I'll, I'll get it out. Might as well. Might as well. Got the extra Kindle points because it was like on a... I, I decided to do it when I got the notification that it was like a double point day for the Kindle store. I was like, might as well. I had just gotten paid for watching the cats. Uh, lessons in Chemistry is currently a library book because uh, support your local libraries even as even if it's through Libby especially if it's through Libby a lot of people like to read electronically these days and so Libby is a fantastic way to do that because not only is it free all you need is your library card and then you're hooked into the systems and I know it counts because whenever I log into my actual library library systems website it shows the it shows the holds that I have through Libby in their system so like it's counting so support your local libraries we need more libraries and we need them to stay open later so I can actually do things because it's not it's like I'm not super poor <laughs> But I'm not rich enough to where I want to spend $23 every time I just want to leave the house. But that's the economy we're in nowadays. And so, yeah, libraries being open open later and longer would be great. It would be fun. It'd be fantastic. Huh. Anything else new? Anything else new? 
I don't think so. Where is this? Where is this light? Where'd it go? It's up there. Here, let's see. Can I chase it? I was like, I... Alright. Backpedal. I was one of those bookworm kids that would rather read than play at recess growing up. And so... It was a little devastating when I couldn't bring myself to read more often as an adult. But now I'm getting back into it. And it's fantastic. And I started again. I started reading again, like middle to late August, and I've, I'm like 26 books in. I think I counted 26 over the year since August. Pretty good. I haven't. I haven't had a whole lot of books that I had to DNF, which is great. But the books that I did have to DNF, some of them were just unfortunate. Because I was really looking forward to it. You. Back people. Hey, I'm excited to... I'm excited to... Uh, track next year's reading. I've got a... I've got a reading log set up and ready. Oh, not a log, but like a journal. It's gonna be fun. I'm excited. I hit, I hit the structure. I'm hoping, I'm hoping that next year I'll be able to read about a hundred books total. And I think that's doable for self, for, for my speed and rate. But we'll see. November was a bit of a reading slump, which I think I only read like five books that month. I don't know. It was wild. I just wanted to do other things. But I also was like, there was a part of me that wanted to read, but that part of me was like overshadowed by like trying to get back into Minecraft too, because I've also been missing Minecraft. But the mental illness is strong. <laughs> nice. And that is that. Let's take a look and see if we are able to buy anything from the manicons. It has only been 30 minutes and I'm already crashing. It really shows that my stamina needs to be built up consistently. Ooh, exactly 32. Let's go. Nice. The mannequins no longer move, which was in fact something that <laughs> the game company called out. What's that? 
Okay. 38 next time. And then 3. So 38 plus 3 is 41. So that's going to be... Let's see, I get... I get 6 candles a day. So 41 divided by 6 would be... Let's see, 6 times 6 is 36. Another 6, so that would be 42. So in about a week. In about a week I'll have enough to get the final two, final two thingy my lovers. Do we have a place for clothes yet? Because we got hairstyles, we got capes, we got music for some reason. This is probably getting the clothes. But not yet. Um, it's gonna be a short stream. <laughs> it's gonna be a short stream. I've talked about, I've, I've exhausted my conversation over up before. Look at all the, look at all the fireworks we've, we've gathered. Insane. Okay. Okay. Fine. Be that way. Let's take a look at this dress. Let's take a look at this dress. Oh, it's cute. Let's put on the sandals that we get. Even just those sandals. It's cute. It's fitting. I like it. Nice. Uh, also, fun fact, I am, in fact, a sucker, and so I got both the moth and the sparrow. I'm like, look at this. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Um, I'll take off the antlers so we can get the full effect. But look at this, it's so cute. It's so cute. Oh, look at the way the cape looks. Look at this. It's cute. I'm in love. Uh, 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 uh. I'm fine. I'm fine. But yeah, I like I like calling the newbies moths. And apparently Sparrow is another name that people would have flying around. Which is neat. And I'm a sucker, and that was like ten bucks, so. <laughs> Oh. oh yeah, if you do want to see what the Sparrow kit looks like, we've got the wings that are like bird wings. Uh, I'm take those off. And then instead of a headpiece, you get a mask, which looks like this. Which if we go over here, I can take off my hair. Um, I'll show you what that looks like. So you got the And it's a cute thing. But like, look at this cape too. Look at this cape. Look at the way it flaps the wings. So cool. So cool. I love it. I, I don't regret it. Alright, we need to go back into our normal form or else I'm gonna combust. I'm sure there's someone out there that would just be like, why do you get all the cosmetics if you're only gonna wear the same four thing? <laughs> you're only gonna wear the same outfit every time. Uh, because I like to change it up when I'm playing off stream. Because I play this game every day. And I like to switch it up for me. God, I want him. Nope. This is around, but where? Where is it hiding? Where is it hiding? And I'll wear the I'll wear the dress till we're till we're done. You good? 
Huh. Interesting. Uh, there's one thing that I want to do before we end the stream. Actually, two things. First of all, I am going to commit and I am going to turn this into my home base because I absolutely love this area. The home island, fantastic. We'll absolutely be going back to visit it on occasion. But the way that they built up Aviary Village, oh, love it. It's fantastic. Really? Alright. See if we can catch up to our friends at the very top over here. sometimes it's like if you do if you do just like there's just little stuff like this that they've got going on in the aviary village and it's fantastic look at them oh my gosh i love it mode I've also had that happen with one of the friends that lays down like right over there it is the our fainting friend I think because I laid is like because I laid down there and it was like the same kind of cinematic and I was like Ooh. so that's fun that's fun this place is so cool I love Aviary Village. I'm very happy about how it's turning out, and I can't wait to see how we get to expand on it even more. I am very curious about the two little branches off of the final mission, the one that's available in five days and the one that's available in 12. Those will be exciting to see what that's about. Oh my god, my back. But until then that is going to be the stream i am so sorry that it had been so long and i'm sorry that this is a short a short stream it's like a double whammy unfortunately um hopefully i'll be able to stream on friday i cannot give any promises because i don't know what's gonna happen but i'm hoping i'm hoping but until then thank you guys so much for hanging about whether you chatted, whether you lurked, whether you're around for the last five minutes, whether you're around for the last 35 minutes, I love and appreciate you all the very same. And I hope you have a fantastic rest of your morning, afternoon, evening, night, wherever it may be, because time zones are weird and I'm never going to quite understand them. But thank you for spending yours with me, and I'll see you next time, whenever that may be. Bye, guys. Bye. 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 <laughs>
enemies closer History repeats itself over and over I've forgotten how all the flowers smell The pity they hold, I cannot tell it all begins When I ring the bell But it's the only way Injustice Still my withering heart Yearns for peace and mercy But I'm ready for revolution now So let the plants tame the ground Burn it down